today I will be painting my dog. In the reference picture, uh, he is a lot smaller and he has grown. So this will be a baby picture of his that I'm going to be painting. sure of what to paint for my first painting video so I decided to paint my dog since I haven't really painted him before really when I paint I start with the darker colors like the shadows and then build my way up to the highlights but I do every now and then go in with the lighter colors just because I do get bored of only working with dark colors. At first I started off with lighter colors and then would do darker colors and then midway through I would just mess it all up and everything would become a mess. And then I looked into YouTube videos and TikToks and from there I learned that it is easier to start with darker colors like shadows and then build your way up. videos. I even want to do an ASMR like something like that but I don't really have a microphone nor a good camera to be able to do that so I just decided I was going to make painting videos which are pretty entertaining to me. music or use my phone to look at the reference image but this time I had to record with my phone and I couldn't really do that so I was just using my laptop for the reference photo and I wasn't listening to music which was actually very sad the whole time it was just silent but it was pretty relaxing in the end. The camera work is is still like in process because I don't really have a tripod or anything so I was just using like boxes to be able to make my phone stand to be recording so I am very sorry for that.
for the little space between his nose and his mouth, I actually didn't use the color gray. I got black and dipped it into water and I kind of made it like watercolor and I spread it out, did um, darker in between where the line was and then faded it out becoming lighter and that's how I did it. It wasn't, it was very hard. I was actually very thinking about um, just using gray, but this ended up working. don't draw animals and when I do they usually don't come out very accurate nor do um, people when I draw them but it, it, I mean the end result was okay I do think I could have done a better job but I am a beginner I just started last year in August so I'm making progress It was a K-drama on Netflix, it's called Squid Game, everyone is talking about it, I didn't really know about it because I stopped watching Netflix a while ago and when I heard about it I thought it was the perfect opportunity to get back into watching shows and so yeah, if you have any K-drama recommendations I would really appreciate it. video I am not pouring in paint and I'm just using the top of the cap and I'm dipping my brush in to get the paint there I do this so that I wouldn't waste paint because I usually don't end up using all of it and I mean I'm saving money so it works
got my art supplies. I got the paint, the brushes, and the notebook all at Walmart. So it is affordable and um, I am working with acrylic paint so it does dry faster. And the little cup of water I have is actually a bottle that was cut. <laughs> yeah. I've seen a lot of people mistaken their uh, cups with cups that actually have a drink in it and they end up drinking it. So this would be a good way to make sure you don't drink your paint water. the white part of his fur I started off with a darker gray so that those would be the shadows and then as you will see later on in the video I will um, gradually go from darker to lighter um, the middle part I mean well not the middle part like the in between the dark gray that I'm using at the moment and the highlight, it's going to be very unnoticeable, mainly because I didn't add too much white, but you can fix it by adding more white. I wish I would have done that, but it's okay. details on the fur for the white spots on his fur and it was kind of difficult especially because I just wanted to kind of you know dip by my on my own and just figure it out but I had to go by the reference and in the end I think it did come out a bit similar but that is just my opinion While I was looking for songs for my video, this one was by far my favorite because it was classical music and I don't know, it just made me feel really happy for some reason. So we've 
we've gotten to the end here I am just fixing up the eye for a little bit of highlight but that's it we're done I last minute decided to add a background color because I thought it was a bit simple I do kind of regret painting the background I do think it looked better with just a white background, but I mean, we can't do anything about it now. I am now officially done with the painting. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.